But I reached this far, so there's no turning back now. Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Ruby Destinies video. In this episode, we are going to be doing some stuff. I'm not exactly sure what this town is for, but we got a little bit of a Pokemart in here, so we're going to go ahead and check it out. Um, we can buy some Pokeballs, so if we do indeed want to do that, we got to sell some stuff first. Uh, we can use the Miracle Seed in the Elite Four, we can put it on Torterra, so we're going to keep that. Ether, Elite Four, also, um, Super Potions, I'm sure we can sell those, uh, get a bit of our money back before we end up, uh, you know, getting some Hyper Potions. So, uh, yeah, Moonstone, never gonna use it, so we're gonna sell that. PP Up, we can use that in the Elite Four, Protein, Elite Four, Paralyze Heal, Burn Heal, we can keep those two. Revives, we need to keep those, Iron, Elite Four, Full Restore, Elite Four, uh, max Revive, Elite 4, Max Ether, Elite 4, Repel, oh, uh, yeah, we need those. Nuggets, okay, we do not need Nuggets. Uh, Leaf Stone, we are not going to use that. Hyper Potion, yeah, we're going to use that later. Great Ball, Ultra Ball, or Repeat Ball, we are never going to use a Repeat Ball. Ultra Ball, uh, we want to keep those. Great Balls, we want to sell five. Um, we have, yeah, we have two Iron Tails, I need to sell that one. Okay, and it looks like that's everything. So, uh, you know what that means? We got, we gotta buy. We gotta buy stuff. So, uh, we're gonna get. So we had one hyper potion. Let's go ahead and buy 19. Cause we got that money though. Okay, we had two ultra balls. Let's go ahead and buy 23. And uh. We have enough revives. Super repels, we can use some of those. We don't need 99 though. We can go with 15. That sounds like a good deal to me. And we can, now that we have those, we can sell these normal repels. Make a bit of our money back. Okay, so, now that we got that all out of the way, we got all of our business done, uh, and we got all of our stuff sold, we uh, are gonna go ahead, and now that we're at this next town, and that we've healed up all of our Pokemon, what we're gonna do is teach Fly, to our Pokemon, and uh, we're going to be teaching it to Beasting, since he is our uh, flying type on this team. So, Fly, we're going to be trading that for Agility. That sounds like a good idea to me, so we're going to do that. Strength, uh, I don't think Zigzagoon has that yet, so, but he can learn it. Okay, well, uh, when we need it, we'll give it to Teddy or so. Flash, Rocks, okay, yeah, I think, we're, I think we're ready. Let's go back to town our hometown and see if uh, anything exciting is going to happen. It looks like there's still much to do in this game, so uh, yeah, we can do that eventually. I don't think it's time to do that yet, but we will do it eventually. Okay, Polaris Town, what is our hometown? I think it was, no it isn't on this island, it's on this island maybe? Sunford, I think so. Yeah, we made it. Okay, this is our hometown. And we got our mom, who's right here. Did your brother give you the badge? Then there, here's something for me, an amulet coin. That means we can make more money. Okay, well, that is cool, I guess. We don't really need it because we already are stinking rich, but you know, that could that could work out eventually, I guess. Uh, here, wait, what, no, 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 no. Wait, okay, what's the location for this town? Green Valley. That is weird. That is very weird. Okay. Um, let's talk to these old people. The city consists of homes built in trees. Perhaps because of that lifestyle, everyone is healthy. Um, okay. Ooh, and we got ourselves a battle right out of the start. Okay, Racer Lee. Good job. Bertle, you're a good guy. Um, let's go and throw on a repel, so that we don't have to run into any wild encounters while we're in here, so, yeah, that's a thing, um, this cave is pretty interesting, I wonder what it's used for, I'm actually not sure, so, uh, let's head back over this way, and, uh, head up in this direction, I think, 
It looks like... I don't know. What are those things? Item, max ether. Let's get out of here and uh, throw on another repel now that we're done with that. And let's head up this way. That looks kind of interesting. Kind of want to see what it is. Okay, it's just two little girls. That's uh, that's completely fine. We're going to battle them and uh, let's go for a razor leaf and uh, aerial ace. Okay, that sounds good enough to me. Let's go for the same thing again. Awesome. And rest. Actually, crap. Okay. Not a big deal, not a big deal. Rest isn't... We already have a Pokemon that knows it. And, uh, you know, Teddy Ursa, he's gonna be needing to sleep all that much, I don't believe. Super Repel. Good thing that we finally got that, because we can make up for it later. Okay, so we got this lady here, and she has a Nummel. Um, so we're gonna go for a few bites. I could have gone for probably a Grass-type, and that would have done just as effective, probably, because of that, uh, Sunbeam, or whatever that she put up. Okay, so Meryl, let's go for a Razor Leaf, and what's next? Uh, hit him on top. We're gonna keep going for some Razor Leaves, and because, uh, you know, Bite is not gonna be effective at all against it. So, let's talk to this old man, conducting research on weird Pokemon. That's cool, I guess. Um, yeah, so, we're in green at the other side of Green Valley, Ring Path. Uh, we got this person. Miltank, uh, let's go for a Razor Leaf. Ooh, and another. Let's go with that. Okay, we beat it. And a Sunflora. That actually would not be a good idea to uh, go for some Razor Leaves because it's a grass type. But, uh, anyway, we got that out of the way, so we can head on over this way. Uh, so, let's talk to this guy and battle him, I guess. Bird Trainer. Uh, Skarmory, so Torterra isn't going to be doing anything for us there. Uh, let's send Rishi out and go for Double Kick. Or a Blaze Kick would actually be more effective beat him, okay, um, I saw that he has, that Stripes has a new item, so let's take that, and it's revive, that is always good, can't wait to get all these, all these revives, and it's Ash, okay, so let's talk to him, hmm, Patrick, hi, it's been a while, not really, there's something here that you can't see, right, now, if I were to see, if I were to use this device on the invisible object, no, no, rather than describing it, I should just show you, that would be more fun, Patrick, are your Pokemon already to battle, okay, Patrick, show me your true power as a trainer, Ash used the Devon Scope. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible and started attacking. Okay, we got a Kecleon. Never gonna use one, so uh, I'm gonna razor leap it up so that we can get just get rid of it, get a bit of experience at the same time. Since uh, Kecleon actually isn't all that great, your Pokemon have obviously grown since I last met you in Pina Francia. I like you to have this Devon Scope. Who knows? There may be other concealed Pokemon. Pa Patrick, I enjoy seeing Pokemon and trainers who strive together. I think you're doing great. Well, let's meet again sometime. Okay, that sounds fun. That sounds fun. Okay, uh, tree. Let's cut that down. And we got this guy. Just spinning in circles. I think he's probably lost. Let's go for... Beasting. Go for an aerial ace. Take it out. Teddy got to level 32. And a skarmory. Let's do some more of this. Uh, why? That isn't going to do anything, but... You know, it's still getting beasting a bit of experience. That's always a good thing. So, yeah, beat him um, with these berries. I haven't gotten any berries in a while that I've passed by. So, I think it's about time for us to get some. Anyway, uh, ooh, quickly on. We're gonna skip around that, I think. And uh, okay, that guy found us. That's completely fine. That's completely fine. But let's go for a Mega Drain. Take out some of our health back, and uh, let's do it again, except that one didn't really work out that well for us. So we're going to go for a Bite and take it out, and a Wheezing. Let's go for a Mega Drain, even though it's, yeah, it's Poison type, so it wouldn't do anything. Bad move on my part, bad move. We could have ended this battle much quicker if we had not done that. So, uh, we're going to keep on going on where we're doing, and um, so how are you guys doing? Uh, I'm getting this series done pretty well. Uh, I got... This is episode 12 already, I mean, that's pretty exciting. I mean, we have already really um, got seven, no, six, six or seven badges, which is pretty, pretty exciting. So I think we did get poison though, so we're going to want to take that poison off and try to, uh, you know, survive a bit longer. And my phone just went off and because, and it's Twitter, okay. 
barely ever get notifications from Twitter. Oh crap. I'm pausing. I'll see you guys in a bit. I need to pick something up. Okay, and we're back. I'm sorry about that. I accidentally spilled a soda on my desk, and I didn't want it to ruin any of the electronics that are on it. So I had to pause it real quick and get that all cleaned up, but it's all fine now. So, uh, yeah, let's just keep on going. We got a lady over here, Gligar. That could, uh, incidentally be kind of cool. Uh, Yappa Berry, okay. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, repel. We need to repel, put up a repel. So let's do that and uh, keep on going where we're going. I think we're going down here. We're going to run away from it, though. I mean, no reason to fight it because uh, we just completely destroy it. Okay, we aren't going that way, so we're going to head... No, we can't go that way either. So that isn't a reasonable place to be headed right now. We gotta head up this way, I do believe. That would make sense. Wanna battle? Hold the red right there. Being really quiet, and then maybe he's just socially awkward. That's probably what happened. Uh, that was a bad move. Let's go for a bite. Or two. Maybe even three. Okay, that did get very, very good. Scyther! Uh, what are we gonna use? We're probably just gonna switch out. Let's go to Beasting. Go for an Aerial Ace, take it out. Very, very good. Uh, okay, so we're gonna keep on going up. Actually, we should use a hyper potion. One of our newly purchased hyper potions, I might add. Pikachu, uh, let's go for Mega Drain. Try to take some of its health back by before, uh, you know, dying. Because that would not be a very good uh, precedent to set. And I just got uh, a text message. I am being popular today. Okay, that is completely fine by me. Uh, not that it shouldn't be. <laughs> um, okay, so, probably should have put my phone on Do Not Disturb like it normally is, but, you know, I, I like feeling like I people want to talk to me, so. Yeah, we're gonna head up out here. Um, we could probably head down that stream, try to find actual civilization, or, you know, we can just keep on going through this tall grass. You know, either of the two should work. Uh, Sloking water type, I'm not sure actually. Uh, out of Mega Drain. Oh yeah, it's psychic type, so. It should, bite should work incidentally, so. Uh, let's head up here maybe, see if there's anything to be done. It looks like there's a. Okay, yeah, we can fight you, I guess. Task form, it's a water type. Let's go for a razor leaf, take it out. Good job, go team. Repels effect wore off. Not a big deal, not a big deal. Except it is a big deal because we're running into a stupid Pokemon. Like Mill Tank. Um, let's go for a super repel. And let's keep on going. Keep on, keep on going. Lust Path. Okay, well, there is incidentally a lady up here. That's kind of weird. Not really, but... Okay. Uh, Hex Maniac. So, looks kind of similar to the one that's in, uh, you know... X and Y. Is the town that we're going to up here, or is it not going to be up here? That is the question. Uh, let's go for some Razor Leaves, even though that we're out of PP for that now, and we're going to have to switch out. Let's keep him in so that he gains a level and then go to Beasting uh, for an Aerial Ace. Take it out. Okay, awesome. Okay, so now we're going to have to switch out Birtle to second place, put him on hold. Okay, we're to move out to Mount Pyre. Well, um, it appears that they're moving out. We're go I'm gonna go check up on the other, you know, area up here, see if actually ring path. Um, okay, so yeah, it looks like this is the only way to, for us to go. So we're gonna head up here and uh, maybe down. Okay, I'm doing good so far, I'm doing good. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, yeah, I'm, hopefully I'm sounding a little bit more energetic than last time in this series. Because I'm trying to add a little bit more inflection like I normally do. This series I've just been not my best, I don't think. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna keep on get, doing what we're doing. Uh, let's go for a quick attack, take it out, awesome. And let's head down this way. Maybe we can surf to where we need to. Oh yeah, this, it says this is a city, so it means that up here maybe there's a Pokemon Center. 
I'm just kind of in need of a Pokemon Center right now, so... You know, if we could find one, that would be completely cool. Uh, down here, please let there be some form of Pokemon Center or healing. Uh, okay, I don't quite understand why this place is a city. I mean, it's composed of many islets. Should this be called <laughs> Rolazo Islet? Okay, and we got the Luminous Canaries guy up here. Hey, you, don't go near the cave in the cove. Why? You don't need a reason. I'm an adult. Just listen to me. That's a bad, bad thing to say, man. I'm, I've beaten you like eight times. You and your goons. What is this place? Is this... It's a motel. Yeah, this is where we're going to be healing up. I think that would make sense. Okay, uh, let's head up here. Yeah, it looks like, actually, this is not going to be where we heal up. So we're going to head on over this way. Maybe up here is something? Okay, no, it's just Tamashi up there. Come on, is there any way for us to heal up in this town? My god. Why have the Pokemon Center at the very end of the island chain? My god. The design of this game, it's just awful, it's atrocious. I'm so sorry, but it just is. Just confusing and not really needed. So, oh well, it's not that big of a deal, but we're gonna head back to uh, where those bad guys were, those baddies, and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make them pay. We're gonna make them pay. Okay, okay, guys, we're gonna make them pay hard. Okay, uh, Snubble, not gonna use you, but you do turn into a fairy type in 6th gen, but you still aren't all that great stat-wise, so, that's the thing. Sorry, man. Okay, uh, Pidgeotto, let's keep on going. Flappy, don't really care. Okay, and, um, so we're in Pyre Path. Oh, I can't run? That's stupid. Okay, well, we're gonna keep on going. We're gonna head down this way, and we're gonna keep on going. I guess. Because I can't run, but maybe they think that this is like an inside area or something. I'm not really sure what the game thinks. It's just being weird. Being very strange. Huh? My Pokenav is ringing again. Click. Uh, hello? Patrick. Is this Patrick speaking? Uh, yeah, I am Patrick. Oh, good. It's me, the ranger you helped out. Oh, hey there. So, may I help you? We've confirmed Shadow Lugia's whereabouts, and I need you to help us out. Blitz. Okay, I'll help you out. Great, thanks. The pickup truck should be arriving there any minute. Johto! Yay! Okay, so we're in the Johto region. Cherry Grove, uh, Johto, what happened here? According to the data we've collected, the people have felt a weird energy coming from the newly formed islands south from here. Okay, but I can't understand. I can't feel anything. Hmm. Maybe it's because you have something that nullifies its effect, and if so, then you're the only one who can help out here. Maybe Lugia's power nullifies the effect. If it, is Blitz on the island too? Probably. For Shadow Lugia did... took him to... after... what? Did take him... God. But it's... but I'm not sure. I have to save him, he's a victim of all this mess, and I have to stop him from falling onto Shadow Lugia's control. Very well, I wish you good luck, and be careful. So we're heading south. Uh, okay. Sounds like a good idea to me. Uh, let's see what this item is first. TMO6. Uh, we may use that eventually. Not really sure where it is, though. So uh, We're going to head up in here and Dark Isle. I think we have a rappel up. So I think we're fine for now, but, you know, whatever. Uh, Zubat. Level 26, so I guess we don't have a repel up. Let's go and put one up. And I just got a new subscriber. Email, yay. Okay, um... I guess I'm heading the other way. Let's head up here. And... I guess we're gonna go as far down as possible. That's what I'm gonna do. That's gonna be my first strategy. And then we'll see where we go from there. Okay, head down here. And I guess we have to head up here now. Maybe. Oh. Is this the place that we've already been to? Maybe. Would not be surprised. 
Let's head up this ladder. This is puzzling. <laughs> Get it? Because it's a puzzle? What is that thing? Duh, what the heck? Uh, let's... So, you are the chosen one. Uh, hmm. You look rather weak than the key of hope. What? Kindly show me your strength, dear Patrick. And I'll show you. Awkward silence. <laughs> we'll get it. Huh? Save your strength to save Blitz. And by the way, why do you wish to save him? Huh? No need to answer. Time will come. Good luck. I wonder who, who that guy was. And I wonder why I want to save Blitz. But I reached this far, so there's no turning back now. Okay, let's head on in. Ah, uh, okay. Well, we're back in outer space. Blitz! Blitz, are you okay? Yes. I'm, I'm feeling perfectly fine. Blitz! This isn't Blitz. Ah. Blitz, hear me out! I can... Shadowlugia! Shadowlugia! I'm not talking to you! Blitz, I know you're there! Ah, Patrick, I can't... Yes, you can! Fight it, Blitz! This is so stupid. Ah. Forgive me. This is so dumb. Okay. Well... Pokemon Threat Blitz. Pidgeot. Pidgeot. Uh, let's go for a Fly. And let's go for a Blaze Kick. Awesome. Did that pretty well. Dark Lugia is coming out next. That means it's Dark type. And Water type, maybe. Meaning that a Fighting type move would probably do very good against it. So, let's go for a Double Kick to see how much we can do with that. Hydro Pump. That is actually not very bad. Let's go and put Wall Puff out and go for an Aurora Beam. Lucario? Uh, that is a very strange looking sprite, but I'm not gonna judge. Took it out. Okay. And, uh, Teddy grew to level 35. Good job, Teddy. Dark Lugia is coming out now, and, uh, let's go for this. And let's go for a Surf. Okay, maybe not. Um, okay, who's going out next? Birdle. Let's go with you. And, uh, Bite, maybe? Mega Drain. Mega Drain. Okay, that doesn't look like it's going to be very effective. Maybe if we're faster, yeah, we can fly a bunch and then try to take it out. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> okay, well, this is uh, not being very effective for us. But that's fine. That is completely fine. Maybe we'll just have to train up a little bit. It is level 45 after all. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea to me. Actually, let me check the time. Yeah, we are at 22 minutes. So I think I'm going to end it off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy this episode. Um, be sure to check back again in the next episode. I will be doing a bit of grinding. Everyone's going to be at least up to level 45, maybe even level 50. So if you guys want to check that out, make sure that you check out the next episode. I'm not really sure. It's going to be up in a few days, so that's the thing. But uh, if you guys did enjoy this, please go ahead and leave it a like and a rating if you didn't, but hopefully not. Uh, anyway, if you please answer the question of the day in the comment section down below. Subscribe if you want to watch the rest of the series, and follow me on Twitter at TheGamingGoatHD. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, have a great day.